told me to fit. I just got him that Switzerland hat. Mm -hmm. I've been trying to give you for a while, but we yes. just touched down in Cleveland. I like to got the Caribbean yes. summer vibe. Yes, that's that Caribbean. Looking good. You've been working out. Yeah, yeah you got the camp collar, mm -hmm. the Yeezys. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Now you yeah. see where I get my style from. Mom, birthday hey, what's weekend. Up? It's my birthday. You happy to see us? I am so happy to see y'all. <laughs> the background looks I so, am so beautiful. Happy to <laughs> I like your dress. Thank you. It's my birthday. So we just got to Cleveland. I got on the Cleveland Guardians 1981 fitted cap from Hat Club, of course. But I'm really happy to be home. The weather is beautiful. What is up everyone? Today is Monday and I got this book bag on like it's like my first day of school. Today is my first day starting my new role at a major tech company working as a developer evangelist, developer relations engineer at Twilio. So I have my computer. I got a new MacBook Air. That was dope. That was my first time getting like a brand new computer where I literally like it was basically an unboxing. Had the paper and everything on it. Also, it's refreshing using like a more modern system opposed to like remotely logging into like an older system or older operating system. But I have to run to the bike shop. I got Lee's bike tuned up because it's been like a year since it had its last tune up and then I have to ship something. So I'm gonna do all this on my lunch break. But I really, I'm not saying I don't have a lunch break, but we don't have like specific hours since so many people on our team are distributed across so many different time zones, which is new. So that's really interesting, but also exciting because that means we don't have to stay on the East Coast, let alone even in the USA. really like this this uh, tripod I got it's like a desktop tripod so it's super lightweight and I can use it as like a like a vlogging tripod but anyways the day the work day's over I'm so tired <laughs> like I didn't even like write any code or really do anything I just sat in meetings and did some onboarding and some training met with my manager been on slack like 95% of the time but for some reason I'm really tired I think it's because I need to get some more sunshine some more vitamin d all right it is the end of my first day of working for a major tech company and one thing i can already notice off rip is just like the personalities of the people i've interacted with who are new joiners as well one thing about tech people is especially when it comes to like comparing it to like insurance that i was in and like investment banking is tech people are they're more chill, obviously, more bubbly. One thing I really enjoy about the company that I'm at right now is it seems like people can really be themselves. Like literally there was a dude in our like 150 plus people welcome webinar, virtual, I don't wanna call it, what's a webinar? Virtual Zoom meeting and he was like on the floor laying with his dog because we were talking about whether or not we are dog, cat, or plant people. I personally am a plant person 
but I'm a more of a dog person. It's just plants are easier to take care of. Big fan of not having adjusted hours and I can kind of work whatever kind of time frame I really want to outside of the obvious like meetings and events that I have on my calendar. Um, so I'm really enjoying that, especially as a content creator, like let's say I wanna make a video and I wanna take some time to do that or I wanna like work out or something like that. As long as it's not interfering with my work or you know, not interfering with any meetings that I have, being able to take that time and do the things that I wanna do during the day and being able to work later on. And that's just because our team is distributed across so many different time zones. Very different feel from the previous companies I've worked at. It's great to be like a tech person working at a tech company opposed to being in some other vertical, business vertical like insurance or banking and then being a tech worker and then making it seem like it's a great tech place when it's really whatever that vertical is and they have tech people not saying that you can't enjoy working at those type of companies because you can and i definitely did but it's nice working at a tech company where the careers are catered towards tech workers like developer relations engineer and evangelism and front-end engineering and other really interesting roles like technical program management things that i'm interested in pursuing in the future have arrived to auto camp cat skills is it cat skills or cat skill i think it's just cat skill nonetheless we plural because i looked up the location and it just says cat skill you know black folks always add s's to the end of everything but we made it here staycation it's our anniversary weekend our two-year anniversary wedding anniversary that is so a very special time of the year for us. We've been really busy. Like we've been in Atlanta, Cleveland. So we've been out of town pretty much every weekend. So we don't want to go too far away from home. And this was pretty spontaneous, but we're really glad we found this place. It's only been open for a month. This like campground, I guess is what you can call it. That's exactly what it is. It's made up of cabins, like premium cabins that are painted in this like black color with this really beautiful maple wood accent color as well for like the steps and premium airstream so we were going to stay in an airstream but lee preferred that we stayed in this premium cabin which i'm not mad at, at all the airstreams look really incredible i'm definitely going to show you all around of course got to get that crazy b-roll going in a place like this but just wanted to talk quickly about where we're staying in the cat skill cat skills <laughs> So now we're just taking a hike around a campgrounds and it looks like it ends, the trail ends. We're just trying to get to know this area a little bit more. I feel like there's a lake somewhere nearby. There's also mountains all around. So we would like to figure out where to go where we can like hike and stuff. Day is Sunday and we actually got up really early, which was kind of surprising because we never really wake up that early on vacation or on the weekend but we woke up at like 8 a.m we went to bed really early i think we were just exhausted from yesterday's travels and just being in the outdoors so this is like what you call glamping but there is still some sort of work required not a ton of work but and by work i mean like just getting the fire set up so we can cook our food walking around and it's been pretty hot so we were pretty tired yesterday and today it's almost like we have this entire section of auto camp to ourselves, which is crazy most people um, left today so there aren't too many cars left so we're one of the few couples or families here on a sunday which is all good with me Porter james sport nylon shorts don't sleep on Porter James Sport. It's almost like a mixture of like a Everlane and ALD. They're big on sustainability. So whenever you purchase something, 
your packaging comes with like a little card that says, hey, you just planted this tree in New Zealand. And of course, we got the Solomons. And this is our anniversary weekend. So of course, I'm rocking the Timex Marlin with the automatic movement that I wore on our wedding day. Such a special, the most important watch. <laughs> Hey, yo, being in the wilderness is hard work. We've been trying to get this fire to light consistently for like 20 minutes now. This is tough, especially when you use a mattress. Hey, yo, I brought popcorn. I'm not totally useless. What's your favorite? <laughs> <laughs> 